Welcome back. In tonight's consumer news, it may soon be harder for a thief to seal your iPhone without getting caught. Apple has filed a patent application that describes a method for the company to capture biometric information to identity unauthorized users. It could capture information such as the fingerprints, videos, and selfies of thieves that would be sent to a server that police could use to find them. Many thieves who nab iPhones and know how to reset the devices use them for themselves or sell them to a third party. This next one is putting a new twist on the term Sunday Fun Day. No matter if you are shopping at a Target store or on Target.com, this Sunday nearly every item available will be marked down by a flat 10%. It's called the Target Run Day event. Here's what you have to do. If you're headed to Target, just grab the coupon from Sunday's weekly ad or text RUN to Target at 827-438 for a mobile coupon. Or if you're shopping online, the extra 10% will automatically apply. No code is needed for that. For a list of everything on the Target Run Day event, that includes, just go over to valleynewslive.com and click on this story. Macy's annual Shop for a Cause charity event has been extended into a weekend-long event this year, and it begins today. The event offers customers a 25% discount on most regular sale and clearance purchases the $5 donation to the March of Dimes. The savings pass is valid online and in stores, but customers donating their $5 in stores may also enter for a chance to win a $500 Macy's gift card. The March of Dimes is a nonprofit organization for pregnancy and baby health. Coming up tonight at 6, it's a story of a burlesque show right in the middle of Fargo. One father says it could have been a little too much for his children to potentially see and hear his story tonight on Valley News Live at 6. But first, medical marijuana has been saving Medicare millions. We'll tell you about it next.